I'm at Mucho Burrito, the fresh Mexican grill. I'm gonna give it a try. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys? It's Dave from Ghetto Van Adventures and at Mucho Burrito. And right now I think I'm gonna play what, uh, the making of my burrito. And you're toasting that? Yes, I am. So the tortillas, if they aren't heated up, they become inflexible and they're more likely to rip. So that's okay. the reason why we heat them up. We okay. like Mexican brown rice with the ancient grains. What do you recommend? Um, I really like the rice. The ancient grains that I really do enjoy it has a quinoa and lentils and wheat in it. So it has a bit of an earthy flavor to it. You can do a scoop of each on the mucho if you like. Okay. Yeah. And would you like some of our sauteed pe pe peppers and onions? Mm, yeah. No, like, no, no, no. No, not feeling them? <laughs> and then I have sweet pins or black chipotle spicy beans. What do you suggest? I really like the black beans. They're my favorite. Okay, I'll hit it. And what kind of meat were you feeling like today? I have chicken. No. I have steak. I need to put some more chicken in. Then I have pulled pork, mm. pulled beef, and chorizo spicy sauce. Is it usually two scoops or one? It's two scoops, and you can choose two different ones as well. Can I get, uh, what do you think of the steak and the chorizo stuff? The steak and chorizo is really good. Okay, I'll do that. See, this is great because you know what you're talking about. I would hope I would. Sometimes you go into places and they say, oh, I, uh, I've never, you know what I mean. Yes. And would you like pico de gallo, medium, or habanero hot salsa? Someone. So this is no spice, medium spice, habanero hot. Medium. 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 Yeah. Can I get all, what else? Can, it, can you put curry in that? Of course you can. You have three other choices, not including the green thing. Uh, what else do you I recommend? have coleslaw, roasted squash, pickled onions. Uh, peach salsa and tomato cucumber salad. I'll try that tomato cucumber. Of course. And all of the, everything that you see here is made in house as well. Oh, okay. Um, pickled onions are really good. Okay. Should I put guacamole on? Of course. Okay. It's made fresh every day. <laughs> it's actually. <accurate. laughs> Would you like any fresh cut cilantro or jalapeno? No, no. No, not feeling it? No. no. Would you like sour cream? What do you think? Yeah? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You want sour cream. Okay. And burrito sauce. It's a chipotle based mayonnaise. Okay. And here's the magic part. See, if I make it at home, that's how I screw it up, right? <laughs> I also make it like really easy. Okay. So you kind of press it all together? Exactly. So the second press, it, it seals it. Okay. And what would you like to drink? Uh, how about a uh, uh, diet? I have diet yes. pepper? Yes. And would you like nice to add any chips and dessert? Oh, uh, no thanks. Okay. Because our chips are made in house with fresh lime juice and salt. <laughs> you know everything on this. One. I do. Is it for here? Uh, it's to go. To go? Okay. Would you like a bag? Please, yes. And did you want to add those chips? You can get them with a side of guac. Uh, or I have our queso cheese, which is a melted nacho cheese. No, I better not. Better not? Okay. So that girl, she was really helpful. And it's nice to see because, you know, sometimes you go in and ask for stuff and they just have no clue. It's like they don't even eat there. And like, if they don't eat there, would you want to eat there? No, I don't think so. So I got the burrito, I got the big one, the huge one. <laughs> I, look at this, I got, I got really big hands. Look at this, it's like a freaking football. It must weigh 
it weighs not ounces, pounds. Like this thing is heavy. And okay, it cost okay with with the pop. I got a pop. Uh, it was thirteen ninety five for this. So this is not cheap, but it's thirteen ninety five. But it's huge. I got a pop for two fifty. Now that's expensive. I think that's expensive for a pop. But let's let's open this up. Okay. Hey, we got it open. I'm gonna get my napkin. Oh, I'm gonna. I got an eating towel because I know this is gonna be a disaster. Okay, let's see how this goes. Oh, that's really good. Oh, I like that. Yep. This thing is just jam-packed. I guess that's why it's so friggin' heavy, but it is really good. Mm. <sighs> Holy crap. Mm. I love burritos. I do. This thing is it's got a little heat. Something's giving it a little heat. But it's so juicy. And it's just freaking huge. Like, I'm serious. I'm, I'm not a small guy. And I'm getting full already. Mm. Woo! I'm serious, this is just like a big lead weight. Look at that. Can you see that? Look at them. Oh, just bombed some on myself, but that looks well. Woo. I don't know if I can do it. I got it. I got it. Now, I will say, keep the wrapper on this because it, you can feel the juices in that inside. So give me a couple minutes and I'll be back. I'm still trying. There's... This is taking me a really long time. Whew. I did it. That was a lot of food. My mouth is still a little hot. I forgot it's that chorizo meat or whatever it is. It's It's got some heat to it. That, I, I shouldn't have ate that much, but that was so good I couldn't stop. Whew. Oh, in there. There's the wrapper, just in case you didn't believe I could eat all that. <laughs> I'm serious, that was absolutely delicious. Um, now, it's a little expensive, eh? $13.95 for a friggin' burrito, but, but, if you ate it normally, you'd likely eat half now and you could have half for another meal. Like, I won't eat again today, I guarantee you that. Because I am just stuffed. Oh my god. Oh, excuse me. But that was so good. It was not hot, hot. It was like, excuse me, temperature wise. It was a medium. Now, like I say, you can get it mild or hot. The meats that I chose, one was a little hot. So that gave it a little steam. 
But the lady in there that was working, she was friggin' awesome. She knew everything. And that's what I like. When I like going in, I like asking people because you know what? They work there. They see the trends. They see everything. And, you know, I like people that can help me out and that sort of stuff because they can make uh, an ordinary meal a little bit better by recommending stuff, right? And she was really good. Okay, guys, if you're buying Mucho Burrito, slide in. Let me know what you think if you've tried them out. I think it's absolutely delicious. I would, like I say, it, it was a little far away out of the way to get here, and it's a little expensive, or I'd likely be eating here all the time. Another place I really like. Anyway, guys, uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, you guys take care. Be safe on the road. Mm -hmm.